Hey, what's up everyone? Hippo TC here. And in today's video, we are going to talk about everything you need to know for the new update for Sea of Thieves called A Pirate's Life. With that being said, let's jump into the video. What's up everyone? Hippo TC here. And I don't even know where to begin with this video, but my goal on this video is to kind of talk about everything that is releasing in Sea of Thieves season three. The biggest thing, obviously, is this whole new Tall Tale campaign, which I'm honestly going to just call it the Sea of Thieves campaign. They have teamed up with Disney and have joined one of the best pirate series ever to exist, and that is the Pirates of the Caribbean. What we know so far is that it is going to be a cinematic style campaign, which honestly, I would probably put it in line with kind of the maiden voyage, something similar along those lines, but a lot more grand and a lot more content to do in this adventure. You're basically going to become a pirate and live as a pirate right next to one of the best pirates ever to exist, and that is Jack. Jack Sparrow. I cannot be more excited. From what we've been able to kind of understand and gather, it is going to be a cinematic experience, very in tune with a tall tale, kind of wrapped around this idea of evil mermaids going to the Sea of the Damned. And it maybe even looks like we are going to see the face of the Kraken. The tall tales experiences have been one of my favorite in any game I've ever played. And to see it kind of acted out here here alongside with Pirates of the Caribbean theme, Jack Sparrow and all of these iconic characters, evil mermaids, even ghost spirits that we're going to be fighting. It just leaves me excited. I'm excited for this update and this just proves to you that Sea of Thieves is going to have a long future and how much better is it going to be with content that is going to have that Pirates of the Caribbean theme. For all we know, one day we are going to see some Sea of Thieves style content in freaking Disney World. Now, with that being said, one of the things I've been talking about a long time in Sea of Thieves is I would love to see a raid type of content, a raid style type of content, very similar to like a Destiny type of game. And this, I believe, is going to be exactly what I've been talking about for a long time. They even kind of give hints of what an awesome mega fight in the sea is going to look like. We are going up against the Dutchman and it looks like it's gonna be this huge naval battle in the Sea of Thieves. And this just aligns right with what I've been talking about forever, which is I've been wanting to see a raid in Sea of Thieves. With the recent gameplay trailer kind of dropping, we see even more of this content and this similarity of like the tall tales and all of those things. And we even finally get to see the face of the Kraken themselves. With all this being said, it is going to be a great experience for not only new players, but for players who've been playing the game for a long time. We also get the new cosmetics that are themed around the Black Pearl, which means I finally get my Black Torn sails. And all in all, this is going to be a great time on the seas. We get to jump into the Sea of the Damned. We are doing a campaign that is the biggest tall tale that we've ever seen or done or anything in Sea of Thieves and all of this is absolutely free. We got naval battles, we got ship battles, we got exploration, we got tall tales. I mean, this update for Sea of Thieves is changing the game forever. And like I said, we get to see the freaking face of Karen. I mean, look at her. She looks terrifying. I mean, it's Karen. 